and all. Myself, Grishma of Grade 9, is standing before you to give the introduction and information of yoga and its benefits. Now, yoga introduction. Yoga is 5,000 year old Indian philosophy that combined exercise, breathing, diet, relaxation and meditation. It is a combination of physical, mental and spiritual discipline. It consists of eight steps known as Astanga, Yama, Niyama, Asana, Pranayama, Pratyahara, Dharana, Dhyana, Samadhi. Yoga is science of healthy and better living physical, mental, intellectual and spiritual. Now, Surya Namaskaras. Pranayama. It helps to re relax the nervous system and maintain the balance of your body. Hasta Uttanasana. It stretches and turns the muscles of the abdomen. Expand the chest, which results in a full intake of oxygen, wherein lung capacity is fully utilized. Hasta Padasana. It makes the waist and spine flexible, stretches the hamstrings and opens the hips, shoulders and arms. Ashva Sanchalasana. It makes the spine and neck flexible and strengthens the leg muscles. It also helps in indigestion and conspiration. Dandasana. It stretches the arms, chest, shoulder and spine, improves posture and calms the mind. Astanga Namaskara. It increases the flexibility of the back and spine. It strengthens the back muscles and reduces stress and anxiety. Bhujangasana. It stretches the shoulders, chest, back, increases flexibility and elevates mood. Parvatasana. It increases the blood flow to the spinal region and strengthens the muscles of the arms and legs. Ashwasanchalasana. It brings flexibility to leg muscles and turns the abdominal organs. Hastapadasana. It stretches the hamstrings and opens the hips, shoulders and arms. Hastapadasana. It stretches and turns the muscles of the abdomen. It expands the chest which results in a full intake of oxygen where lung capacity is fully utilized. Pranamasana It centers thighs, knees and ankles and improves posture. Now Padmasana Calm the brain, increases awareness and attentiveness helps develop good posture, is this menstrual discomfort and sciatica, helps keeps joints and ligaments flexible, stimulates the spine, pelvis, abdomen and bladder, restores energy levels. Yoga Mudrasana Yoga Mudrasana brings flexibility to the back, spine and the hips. It this asana turns all organs in the abdomen. It helps to relieve organs and improves digestion. Now, Vajrasana. Vajrasana helps better blood circulation in the body. It modifies the blood flow by reducing the blood flow in lower portion, especially in the legs and increasing blood flow to the digestive organs, resulting to efficiency of the digestive system. Ustrasana. Reduce fat on thigh, strengthens the shoulders and back, improving respiration, relieves lower back pain, improve flexibility. Kutkatasana Strengthens hip flexors, ankles, calves and back, stretches chest and shoulders, reduces symptoms of feet, stimulates the heart, diaphragm and abdominal organs. Vrikshasana helps improve body balance, strengthens your legs, thighs, spine, shoulders and arms, turns your arm and leg muscles, 
known to reduce risk of sciatica. Natarajasana. Strengthen as legs, hips, ankles, and chest. It helps to reduce weight, stretches the thighs, groin, and abdominal organs. Improves digestive system. Novasana. It cleanses your kidneys and facilities fresh blood supply, thus riding for your body to of toxins. It produces varna flow throughout your body. It bold builds willpower, determination and self-control. Sarvangasana Enhances blood circulation in the pelvic region, loosen up the spinal column and strengthens the muscles of the neck and lower back. Helps to remove excess fat from abdomen and thigh. Thank you friends.